file was here, you know what that means. Yeah, boy. <laughs> hey, everybody, and welcome to vlog episode 14. Oh, man, I've been way behind. Do me a favor. Hit that uh, subscribe button right down there. Turn on that notification bell. Otherwise, you won't know when I upload anything. Even my own brother said he ain't seeing my videos. So, do that. Help me push my algorithm up. And hit that like button for me. Alright, well today, <laughs> this was a little unexpected. My new relay came in way early. I literally just went to the mailbox. It can't came back out to get the keys to see if it's gonna work this time. Uh I don't know, but we will see. I'm gonna leave y'all sitting right here and I'm gonna go pop it in the truck. I'll be right back. All right, this is number one. This is the original. Pulling out the original. Putting in the new one now. Got to say, I'm a little disappointed. Um, <sighs> thought it was supposed to be for LED. Hyper flashing. It ain't. So, you know what? I think at this point I'm just going to live with it. You know, I'm going to replace all the LEDs anyway. And would it be that? Which is, in a way, just between me and you, I actually kind of like having the hyper flash because it's, no it's more noticeable as opposed to the regular flashing. You know it flashing real fast it's a little bit more attention grabbing I mean that's just me you know but a little clicker on it, it does sound a little bit different uh, than <laughs> the stock one um, I'll show you right here as you know right there is our solenoid not solenoid relay Anyhow, okay, all right, this is the new one, all right, and this is the old one, You notice a slightly different tone to it. I don't know if it's just me or what, but let me know down in the comments. And oh, whoa, that's way too zoomed. Okay, let me know down in the comments. Is this in my mind, or does it really sound different? Does it have more like of a soft tone to it? As opposed to red drum being a clicky tone. <sighs> My next project I want to do this truck is the doorbell buzzer. I want to put one out of a, uh, what is it? I'm not good with Camaros. I think it's a second generation Camaro. It's a 90s Camaro, okay? As most of y'all know, the door buzzer on this well, uh, stock door buzzer is like that. See, I got my leaving my lights on like that. Okay, <clears throat> the Camaro's got more of a modern uh, ding, 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 ding sound to it. As opposed to a solid, be more like 
like that. Yeah, uh, it's one of them weird little things. <sighs> That's like I said, a future project. And that, in case you're wondering, is located right above where I put that uh, relay, right up in here in this area. In fact, I took it out a couple times right here. Let's see if I can get it on camera. There, that's it. That's as close as I can get it. But anyhow, I don't change out on that. And a couple other miscellaneous things I want to do to this truck. Um, but, I mean, that's why they call them a project truck. Project cars, you are never done with them. <laughs> <sighs> hmm. All right. Oh, I got a little bit of a secret to show you. Don't tell anybody this. And we got us a little bit of a hot air intake. <laughs> Sometimes I like to uh, keep, you know, flip it, make a little bit more noise. Yeah. And sometimes I just gets too loud for me. I flip it back over. Just depends on what kind of mood I'm in. Yeah. All right. Also. I got to top off the power steering fluid. It's getting a little low. Believe it or not, it'll be the first time since I've had this truck that I've put power steering fluid in it. So, <sighs> got my fluid right there, and there's the pump. Got that out of the way. And this here crank up. What you say? All right. Well, <laughs> I apologize for about dropping y'all into the fan. That wouldn't have been fun. I mean, I know y'all fans, but you don't want to get fanned. <laughs> no pun intended. Yeah. All right. Well, let's see what this puppy's got. Um. I ain't done this in a long time, but I'm in the mood for it. So, <sighs> wish me luck. See you there. Who says uh, 305 can't do a burnout? Might be a one wheel pill, but <laughs> she'll spin them wheels even on 31 mud tires. Yeah, this is highly out of character for me, but <laughs> yeah, she peeled it. Right on down. Right on down till I let off the gas pedal. Anyhow, I wanted something cinematic, and that was it. Ain't been able to do much. My hip, 
but <laughs> uh, man, that whoo, it gets my juices flowing. <clears throat> and I love to take that truck out in the field, and just let loose. But I ain't got an area big enough to do that. <laughs> Not without hitting a few things and messing things up. All right. Uh, I'll see y'all in the next segment. All right. Bye. All right. Now I'm fixing to tackle something that's kind of long overdue, and that's <laughs> upgrading my uh, storage space here on my computer. I have just about tore through every bit of my storage, and it keep carrying this on and I've got to have a bigger hard drive. So, let me show you kind of what I'm talking about. Okay. Now, I don't know how well this is going to come off. How good quality. I'm trying to hold the camera in one hand and run this in the other. But anyhow, as you can see right here. Okay, my main drive is a uh, 500... Gigabyte uh, Samsung Evo SSD. Okay, this is where I've been storing all my stuff on to my vlogging right here. Airbot hard drive, which I put all my programs and games and what. A few moments later, many months later, one eternity later. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. I hardly even handle one video that's been a <laughs> zip. So, <sighs> which brings my need. Yee. Okay, which brings my need to uh, upgrade my drive. Now, I'm not going to upgrade my <clears throat> main drive, which is the SSD. That's why I'm running my OS on, my operating system. But I need a bigger hard drive for straight storage. So that's what I got right here. In this box contains about one of the biggest hard drives <laughs> you can buy. You'll see in a second. Hang on, let me get it up and up. You'd think for a drive like that, they'd have uh, better packaging. At least they didn't ship it straight in this box. I almost feel like I'm opening up a pack of candy with this. And... 16 terabytes. That is... Converted... 16 thousand gigabytes because one terabyte is 1,000 gigabytes I hope I'm right on that and this thing is huge like wow look how thick that is that's like the thickness of uh, <laughs> my old uh, Windows 98 hard drive which, hang on, I got it right here. I'll show it. Okay. This is a hard drive from 1998 or 1999. Can't remember which one. I'm wanting to say 98. Nope, the date code. Uh, July of 1999. Oh. Alright, and this is the... Uh, 16 uh, terabyte drive. I mean, wow. In fact, yeah, I think it's actually bigger. But I'll go ahead, uh, pull 
my computer out, opened the lid on it, and I found a place to put this puppy. Alright, I will see y'all in just one second. Well, for me, it's going to be probably five minutes. For y'all, it's going to be one second. If I shut my mouth. Alright. See you in a second. Boop. Alright, let's get to tear this thing apart. Oh, and I think this is the first time I've showed my setup here. This was, well, the hard drive I showed you a while ago. That's what this came out of. This is my first computer from 1999. And I started wanting to take my YouTube more serious. I knew I had to have a better setup. So, I decided to build my own computer. And I looked all around, couldn't find a single case I liked. So finally, I decided to go ahead and just use this case. Uh, rebuild something from my childhood. Fix it up. So, that's what I did. I mean, you know, it ain't much graphics card is. I think it's a 1080... TI. The processor is AMD uh, 5 3600. Eh, I can't remember. I'll put the uh, correct specs in here. But anyhow. Alright, well, <laughs> a lot has went on between now and then. <sighs> Let's just say I found a place to put my uh, new hard drive. I had to end up taking out all my other hard drives. So, what I done was I vacuum sealed them and put them in the fireproof safe. You know, to keep moisture and stuff out of it. And in the event of a fire, you know, it protects it. I mean, it's got all my data on it. Family pictures, videos, whatnot. I just transferred all that to the 16 terabyte hard drive. <sighs> but anyhow, I did end up having to uh <laughs> upgrade my ssd anyway um long story short <laughs> my other ssd moving everything around it literally fell apart yeah so i went ahead and upgraded to m.2 it's not the best hard drive in the world um, I'm planning on later on upgrading it to a better one maybe a one terabyte Samsung Evo M.2 SSD but I'm getting nerdy right now <sighs> yeah <laughs> I went straight from talking about cars to talking about computers you see how crazy I am. Yeah, <laughs> I got more than one interest. Anyhow, that's why I made setting up a YouTube channel so hard. <laughs> but anyhow, in the process, I ended up upgrading my uh, power supply to a Corsair uh, 500. 550 watt uh, power supply unit. Of course, you know it's got the RGB on it and all that. Them bells and whistles. <sighs> and not else much has changed. Um, I need to do a little bit of more cable management in here, but I mean, <sighs> what do you expect? It's a. Uh, <laughs> Gosh, what? Over 20 year old case. So, what do you expect? Anyhow, alright. I believe that is going to wrap that up for this here. <sighs> alright, well, I will see y'all <laughs> in the uh, next segment. Alright, love y'all. See y'all there. Bye. All right, <laughs> well, I'm ending it in the same spot I started it. <sighs> Today is October the 20th, 2019.
2021 and I've been way behind on everything this past summer has been rough with my hip uh, got behind on housework yard work uh, computer work vlogging everything as you can see right here plainly <laughs> everything is a little overgrown and my tomato is dead well it was running out of season anyway but anyhow now thank the lord i am doing a good bit better with it and i'm getting back on track oh let me show you this here <laughs> right here i mean that's that's pitiful yeah <laughs> and that's how i started the year uh was trying to get caught up and I promise you, usually, last year, before this uh, problem in my hip, man, this yard was impeccable. I mean, I was mowing sometimes twice a week. You know, I stayed behind it, trimmed all of it. But this year... <laughs> It looks like somebody just up and abandoned everything. But, like I said, good news is I'm definitely on the mend. I'm getting called up first on housework. And I'm thinking maybe sometime tomorrow I'll come out here and mow, whatnot. And also getting some new curtains <laughs> for the uh, bedroom slash office uh new blind because i'll show you right here i'll teleport all right i'll see y'all on the other side of the house Ooh, all right <laughs> ah movie magic anyhow well i got it all the way up but you can't hardly see it but it that poor old blind it's about had it and hey there's sweet pea. You see straight into my room. See my computer right there. R RGBs and bells and the whistles, whatnot. Anyhow, oh yeah, and this. This air conditioner, that sucker's probably older than I am, and it was <laughs> given to me by my brother and I tell you that thing will out cool our brand new air con window air conditioner I mean that thing will freeze your butt off and that ain't no lie the other one huh, it puts out cool air you know but you can't beat old school <laughs> that's how it is with uh, uh, <clears throat> these newer cars the older uh freon boy that stuff whew. you can hear the dash cracking it gets so cold but anyhow let me think here all right i'm going to teleport for a moment show you my curtains then i'm going to come back out here and we'll end the video all right to the bedroom all right here we are this is what i was talking about right there you can see that's pitiful right there <laughs> that there is even worse and hey sweet pea yeah say hey you ain't gonna say hey no okay there you go yeah as you can see <laughs> blinds those are torn off to pieces thanks to her and uh, anyhow I got a new line for that and I got two new blackout curtains 
so it should be nice and you ain't gone crazy that is a truck grill in my bedroom plan on taking it using it as a lamp uh, it's busted several places from where the previous owner Yeah, it's busted in several places from the, pre from the previous owner, like right there, you know, there, whatnot. So, I plan on taking it using it as a lamp to uh, hang up on the wall. Um, my plan is to put the original lights back in it, try to get them cleaned up, polished up, and take a little lamp like what you see out of one of these that's a flea trap it's just like a little uh, Christmas candle bulb type lamp put that in there and I'm wanting to take it and set it up about right up in there and I'll give you a little showdown of this that there is a Tim McGraw poster that I won back in 2012 yet signed and autographed and if you're in Dukes of Hazard, which I'm sure you are, you know that's Cooter right here, Ben Jones. That's a signed picture beside a uh, original coloring book from back in the day. And when my, I was a baby, my parents went to a uh, George Jones concert. And rumor has it <laughs> with that hat when I was a baby. Uh, George Jones put it on his head. That's what the vendor said. Anyhow, that's the urban legend. So, you know. <laughs> Alright, well, okay. Now, let's go back outside. Alright, well, <laughs> thank you for watching. If you will, consider subscribing right down here in this video right here that's what i want you to watch these two videos right up here that's kind of why i want you to watch so do me a favor subscribe see y'all later love y'all god bless